And welcome back folks, welcome back to Let's Play Full Throttle. Last time we entered the we entered Toth's junkyard here and found out that there are some forks that we could use. But the problem there was a problem that there was that 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 there was a dog that was trying to kill us, um <clears throat> trying to eat our face. So we need to use this piece of meat. Here, poochie pooch. Pooch. On the thing. Don't have to eat much. Okay, and now we need to somehow. Uh. Okay, how do I actually. Hmm. We figured out one part of the puzzle. Um, we don't know where to apply the meat. But the question is, how do we actually activate? Um, uh, the magnetic lift. Hmm. Can't reach it. Okay, now we. We are, uh, now we don't have this piece of meat anymore. Uh, hmm. That might be a problem. I don't I don't suppose we can just pick up the fox now. No, of course not. Mm. Down. Bad dog. Mm. Let's check um Ah, I think the place maybe continues? No, it doesn't. Just this one screen here. Mm. Yes. We could we could uh, open the lock again, I think.
Yeah, but th that doesn't do anything. Hmm. Let us make sure that they are. That I didn't miss anything. Um, any path or anything clickable here. But it just appears that there are some generic wrecks in the background. Cars. No, thank you. Hmm. There must be something that we can do on that other screen. Okay, come on. Let's just yeah, look at Okay, that's that's not fast enough. Hmm. That's not fast enough. I wonder if, if uh, we can actually perform any action at all, or whether it just triggers automatically um, this cutscene when when I enter this when I enter the screen. Okay. Let us. Hey, I indeed missed something. There's a way. There's a way up there. Ah, okay. Uh, now I have to... Ah, uh, it's a mini game. Okay. Okay, there's... Hmm. There's a button I can press. Okay. Ah. And the mouse controls. Okay. No, no, no. Go over there. No. Yeah, and, and down. 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 Okay. 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 Okay, that should do it, I think. It doesn't kill the dog. So maybe just keep it in a position. But the dogs, the dog could still jump out of the window then. Just leave it at that. I think uh, that should have taken care of our problem. Uh, 
Let's see whether this is the case or not. <clears throat> ah. Nice forks. Where'd you find them? Right next to the knives and spoons. Now, if you could just find me a welding torch and scare up some gas, we'd be set. Okay, solved one puzzle. Two more to go. Um. Hmm. Now about the gasoline and the torch. Still have no idea how to distract the guy or yeah with the torch or what to do what to do with it i don't want to hurt mo's mailbox hmm at least we now know that and um, the guy with the torch the puzzle of the guy with the torch doesn't involve the piece of the piece of meat okay then Maybe we need to go back and grab the lock. Uh, hmm. I wonder. I actually wonder whether... The puzzle of the guy with the torch actually involves a dog that's in the junkyard. I wonder if we can go back. Can we go back? Oops. Sorry. I just hit the microphone there. Okay. Can we go back? We can. Okay. Hmm. But I don't think we can really set the dog free. Hmm. Well, let's let's check. Let's check. Maybe there is something to do with the dog. Um. Okay, where are you going? Okay, there was a way up. Can I not click on it anymore? Oh, there's a car. That one ill-tempered mongrel. Hmm. Oops. Oops, sorry. Hit the microphone again. Um. Yeah, I guess when we... When we come back, folks, we will, uh, yeah, see whether there's anything that we could do with the dog um, and how to get that torch. So, until next time, folks. Um, till then.